What is up everyone? I am the winner and welcome to our game room. Today we're going to take a look at the game that came in ranked 48th in my top 123 games of all time. Today's game is one that many people know and many people play. You can tell by every time they put a Kickstarter on it makes millions of dollars, which is great for them, but I kind of stopped <laughs> joining that crowd after a while because... They get a little add-on happy, and by now you kind of probably understand it's a Simon game, and that Simon game is Zombicide. Uh, this is the OG Zombicide, the very first version. Uh, I also have the Black Plague version. That system works a little bit more efficiently than this one because the whole change rule of hey look if your buddy is in a spot with a bunch of zombies and you do a ranged attack you shoot your buddy first that was a weird rule in this one we kind of play this one by the new rule of if you miss then you shoot your buddy which is a better rule it makes more sense thematically because you're not going to try to shoot your buddy in the ring but anyways this is a minis game where you are a bunch of survivors trying to do some sort of goal in a zombie infested city uh like i said i have the black plague version as well but i i enjoy the more like modern theme the, like at this point they have a space theme a wild west theme they, they just have one on kickstarter right now that takes the black plague system and makes it almost winter is coming sort of ish theme but i kind of still like the OG because of the fact that you can have all of the the parodies of characters and stuff. I, I enjoy that still. This one is it, it's it went up a spot. I think this is kind of where it's gonna settle. This thing used to be in my top twenty uh, because I really do enjoy the game. It's a, just a big romp. It's just a beer and pretzels type game. It's it's nothing you take too seriously. Uh, the game length can vary depending on the, situ the scenarios you choose. Like, one, a couple of them only has six tiles, and those ones can take you, like, an hour. But then there's ones that have, like, nine, or you can make up your own scenarios that take a, a lot more tiles. And those games are obviously going to take a little longer to play. We played some... We went on vacation with a bunch of families, and we played a game, a huge game, with, like, eight of us or something. That game took, like, four hours. It was a little kind of ridiculous... But it was fun. Uh, this game's always a fun dice chucker. I can't say a whole lot bad about Zombicide. Uh, again, I'm not going to jump in on all the newer versions. I kind of want to see what the second edition has different than this one. I, I think it's probably just the rules changes that we already implement in this one anyway. Uh, but yeah, if you're looking for just a beer and pretzels, roll dice and kill zombies game, then Zombicide is definitely one to look for. Uh, that was my number 48 in my top 123, so come back tomorrow and we'll see what number 47 is. So as always, thanks for watching, keep playing, and keep winning.